Good morning, everybody. Good morning, my Benjamin family. Welcome, welcome, welcome to another day of let's see what the trading gods give us. So we had the CPI come out this morning and it was absolutely horrendous. Consumer price index, which kind of measures inflation. And uh, that's why we got this big spike down in the spiders this morning, which really just brought us if we go to our uh, weekly chart. Brought us exactly to the 9 EMA on the weekly. Ended up being a good early trade. I mean, exactly. I think it went like 10 cents below it. So we're going to be very patient this morning, as always. Let things set up. we got some bids out there in stocks that are way away from where they're trading now. Yeah, bonds are getting a smackdown. Fubo on the list. Would I short Fubo at 22.80? What do you got there? I don't see anything, but yeah, I would probably short it at 2280. That's up a buck fifty from here. So the answer is yes. We got a little bit out in coin, down eight dollars from here. 291 is a level on a 30 minute chart. Yeah, Fubo's gonna be on the radar. Solly wants to buy some weakless and Roblex. All right, well, we got a little bid down 70 if we spike down. Four dollars from here is good. Is good. UPST seventy three for Roblox. All right, a little close for me on the opening, Steve. Let's see what happens after it opens. Again, not in a hurry this morning. Let everything set up. A uh, bunch of people. We were looking at Fubo yesterday before the earnings, and we were looking at the twenty calls. They were like, I think sixty cents. So I think some people in the room grabbed a bunch of those and they're nicely in the money now. And we talked about it before earnings. 71.14 Roblox, 72.37. All right. Let's see what happens when it opens Roblox. You're bidding 70.33. All right, I'm going to make that a real order in Roblox if we go down $4. Do it small. I mean, it'll certainly be a far from moving average trade down there anyway, which we'll explain to everybody if we get it. 70, we'll go 70, 50. So we don't miss it by a little bit if it specs down there. UPS, wow, UPS ended up being a really good short up there, huh? That's a bloody mess. Yeah, 209 is fine in UPS if we move in that direction. That's the bell. Ding, ding. Coin bouncing. Facebook bouncing. Mara bouncing. And Vax certainly bouncing. All right, these stocks make some wackadoodle moves early in the morning. You really just don't want to be involved this early. I mean, we'll short that uh, NVAX if it gets up to 140 for shizzle. For shizzle, which I don't think is going to happen. Right to the spiders. It's like this, you know, when you're in a bull market like this, they just freaking discount everything bad. No, we are out of our Palantir swing trade. I think whoever was in it cleared up this morning. If it gets back to 1830, I kind of like it. Otherwise, Nicholas, I don't know. I like it long, long term, but for a trade, well, we bought it at 1650 yesterday. Now, I don't know. See what happens. Ooh. Ooh, e, ooh, uh, uh. Wow. All right, 93.06 in you. Let's check the spread in this. Not bad, right? Let's put a little short at 93 in you. That would be really stretched out, right? Faster the better. You know it's going to go straight down that. Let's pop it out just in case. All right. We'll give it a few minutes. We'll see if it sets up for a trender. Beat earnings revenue. Yeah, that's okay. UPST. Another stock I hate, Gus. But 108.25, I think we got to try that. UPST. All right. We'll do it small. Went up to 115. Holy crap. 
we'll see if we get the SmackDown. SmackDown. Roblex. Ah. Spike up, spike down. Well, we bought the 20 calls, so, you know, they were supposed to be sold in the morning. Let's see what happens. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, bing, bang, bada, bing, bang. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, bing, bang, bada, bada, bing, bang. Oh, we got upstart. All right, this thing is wackadoodle, so I'm going to give it a little room. This thing's a pain in the ass. It's got a dollar spread. Upstart. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, we're going to add a little at 106. See what happens. Let's give it a minute. I know this thing's a pain in the in the, in the the boot camps. That's why I hate it. I told you guys I hate this freaking stock. Put some out at 108.50. Get a bounce. One oh eight fifty and one oh nine twenty. It did say I hate this stock. Good. If you didn't get the order in time, don't worry about it. I hate this thing. It's a piece of dog poop. Absolutely hate it. Let's see what happens if it gets to 106. It is a wackadoodle stock. Light. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, bing, bang, bada, bada, bing, bang. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, bing, bang, bada, 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 bang. Just keep your eyes on the upstart. Keep it small. I hate this thing. Did it just get halted? Tell me it didn't just get halted. No, it's just kind of just sitting here. Well, I'll put something to sell at 107 if we get a bounce. Because we bought some at 106. Uh, uh, breaks 105, just get out of this piece of crap. Uh, 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 LMND. Oh, wow. That was a far from moving average trade. Wow, 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 wow. All right, we sold some at 107 in that thing. So I think 107.50 makes us even in this. We'll just do it if we get that. That is one piece of crap. Wow, lemonade. We almost got, that was 63.20. Holy crap. All right, in this uh, upstart, we almost got out of all of it. I'm going to add a little bit at 104.50. We'll get a bounce in this thing at some point. <laughs> Getting out up there was the key, right? That was the key. I hope everybody got out all the way up there. <laughs> Who put this on our radar this morning? That's what I want to know. Who was the masked man who put this on my radar? <laughs> it's back to 105.50, 106. We're out. What a piece of crap. Uh, 
Uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh, uh,
The spread we see when we put up the, the market maker. I'll show you in a minute. Yes, the difference between the bid and the ask on level two. That is correct. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. What do I do with my Palantir? Let's take a look. Where are you in Palantir? I like Palantir back down at 8, 1830 for a trade. You, ah, you is beautiful off that level. Yeah, I don't think the market has any idea what it wants to do. I'm sorry. I'll stop singing this song. <laughs> I don't realize I'm doing it. Yeah, I mean, UPST, if it gets to 100 again, we can start looking far for moving average. That's the only way I'd play it now. I told you guys I hate this stock, and I do. I bad for getting involved, but whatever. A little paper cut. Yeah, we can cancel the U bid for now at 84.10. That ain't happening. Well, let's give it another minute. Give it another minute. Let's see what happened. Mara. Mara's a bloody mess sitting right in the middle of everything. Right? Spiking up, spiking down. There's nothing here. Netflix, what are you doing in Netflix, Sally? Nothing. OCGN. Ah, maybe we buy some OCGN on a pullback. You got to buy some size if you like it. If you like it. Coin. I got 297 in coin, which I like. You got 298. What's 298? I like 297. Tell me what 298 is, and I might do it. Mm -hmm. Nah, I would wait. Wait till 297. Ah, the coin is like a uh, hundred percent margin now. Peloton 9372 weekly. All right, but we want to buy Peloton on a pullback, guys and gals, if we can. And 94 is a short, but Peloton's a better buy. We'll definitely short 9365, but I don't think we're going in that direction. Not going to happen. You bounce. Cancel that one for now, guys and gals. Fubo bounced it to 200. All right. Yeah, it didn't quite get there, but that's a nice 50-cent trade in Fubo. I like it. That was nice. Just didn't quite get there. Didn't quite get there. All right, cancel that upstart. I'm done with that piece of shit. <laughs> Roku. Roku's getting far from moving average, right? Don't quite have the ADRSI yet. But maybe we put a little marker at 318. It's getting stretched. Another one, hard to get a far from moving average because it's a little bit spready. But I think 320 is going to be $10 away. So let's keep our eyes on it. Plug Power and FUBU. Uh, I can't buy FUBU after it goes up a dollar. All right. I'm going to put a little order out in um, Roku at 320. Small. And then we're definitely going to look for off a moving average. We just got a little feel around at 318. If you get a dollar on it, I would just take it. What are we doing in Netflix? Who's in Netflix? Who bought Netflix? Talk to me, guys. OCGN. 
let's look. I mean, OCGN's fine. I think it's fine. You got a dollar in lemonade from where? Yeah, if you got a dollar in lemonade, take it. It's a trade. What did you get? A fall from moving average trade in that? Yeah, take it. It's a trade. It's a trade. It's a trade. Watching Netflix 492. Okay. Oh, all right. So I grabbed a little at 492. OCGN, you got to see if it just consolidates up here. You know, you want to, you just buy some here and you add to it at 1012. UPST bounced. Yeah, but it was just a shit trade, UPST. I hate that stock. It was just shit. It was a bad trade, bottom line. Lucky if it worked out, but it was not a good trade, period. When I say I don't like certain stocks, someone posted it in the room. I tried it. No big deal. CRSR. Eh, not doing much of anything, CRSR. Kind of just hanging in the woods. Eh, it looks like a better buy than sell, but there's not a lot of volume. Again, Roku, guys, I want to start at 320, and then we'll look for something for the far from moving average trade. It's getting really stretched. You know, we still only have like a uh, 72 RSI. I mean, 120 would have been great. We just would have got a quick dollar out of it. Oh, my God. We missed it by four cents. It went down a dollar fifty. <laughs> oh, you got to be kidding me. Jeez, Louise. Coin? No. The coin's sitting right in the middle of everything now. It's not a trade. Did you get the Roku short, Jim? Yeah, quick dollar. That's all it was worth. I think it's probably going to go higher. So let's wait till 321 now. Let's see what happens. Labu. 5852 trend trade. Yes, Labu's a good trend on a pullback. I give you permission. 5852. No, I'm not chasing Roku now. Let's get to 321. I'll short a little bit. I still think it's a better short. We'll see what happens. Peloton is a better buy, guys. Yes. Put in a trend trade in Peloton at 90. It's good. It's good. It's good. There's your dipsy doodle in uh, Roku, right? Boom, chaka, laka, laka. Boom, chaka, laka, laka. So really, the far from moving average trade gave you like $2. Not bad. Not bad. Tesla. Uh, again, Tesla's probably a better buy. Roku was the trade of the day, guys. 320 to 317 in about 10 seconds. Rocket Man. Rocket Man. I'm the Rocket Man. Again, Rocket Man looks like a better buy. You know, I wouldn't wait. I'd wait till it comes to add a consolidation to get it. I uh, can't believe we missed Roku by one penny. One penny. Oh, some people got it. They cheated a little bit. Yeah, the spiders are doing nothing. The overall market is just dead quiet. Fubo. Again, I'm not buying Fubo up here. It already made its move. A lot of the Dow stocks reversed. Yeah, and then they spiked down. I mean, I don't, I don't see it right now. ARRY, far from moving average. Let's look. Um, no, I'll tell you why. It's not a dollar away from the moving average in ARRY. I'd rather be short ARRY on a rally you know you got a big bid down at 1420 that's good but otherwise i'd be i'd rather be short not long 
Beyond trend trade setup. Let's look. Yes, Beyond is setting up for a trend. A lot of that. Yeah, we're bouncing around. I would just do dead flat right now, right? DHI, 9750. Yep, DHI is a nice trend trade. 9760, 9818, two good levels, Julian. I like, I like, I like. ONTX. Ah, not something we're going to trade. ONTX is a lottery ticket. Botund. If you like it, you buy it, you put it away, you forget about it. But it's not a trade, a trading stock. Not a trading stock. EA Sports, it's in the game. What do we got? Sitting on a pivot point at 139. I don't see anything there. You, let's look at you. Yeah, let's go you guys. 8410, you. Good eyes there, Jim. I like it. Ooh. 8410 if we get there. Be a little aggressive there. 200 shares. That'll be down $3. Should get a bouncy bounce off that if we get that. I mean, the stock was just 87, right? Oil inventories. WIX down 50 points. Yeah, that thing doesn't trade. No, it's trading a little bit. It gave you a far from moving average trade, too. Tilray? No. Tilray will never be a far from moving average trade. Negativa. It's, it's uh, 10 cents above the moving average. Took you at 85.25, but sold real quick. All right. Let's see if we can get the smack of DACA. I like the 84.10 level for a trade anyway. Yeah, I think they're coming in a little bit now. Yeah, I mean, look, I could have made money in Upstart if I just stayed in and it got back to my price and then and then some. But whatever. When it's a bad trade, it's a bad trade. Coin. I mean, coin could be a decent trend trade. This thing is strong, right? Coin. But the only problem with coin is we were down, you know, six points from here. So hard to trust a trend right now. Light down 12 and still looks like a short if it gets up to a trend line. JMIA. Nothing. You bounce. Kiss my took us, you. You. I hate you. I think use a better short now, guys and gals. Right? If we can get a rally up to the trend line now, I like to shorten you. 86.72 and 87.24. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Tesla waking up. NVAX waking up. Yeah, look at Tess. Wow. $5 spike up in Tesla. Holy mackerel. NVAX. All right, we can try it small, right? 135.20 NVAX. Kind of just came close. Let's look. You're in and out of NVAX already? 135.30 was the level. It got to 135.50. Again, you know what? Let me show you guys what I'm talking about with the spread. Difference between the bid and the offer. It's 50 cents in NVAX. I, I don't want to trade stocks with a 50 cent spread. So, not for me. Not for me. All right, you's coming in a little bit. Now, I'll give you another minute here. Literally. Let's see what happens. Give it another minute. Maybe we get it on this pop down. I don't want it soon, though. Neo. 
Matt Neal can get going here. Might be a better buy if we can go sideways a little bit for a minute. All right? Looks like it wants to break out, Neo. Give it a little consolidation. Netflix is ugly. Yeah, Rich, I was waiting in the uh, you to that 8410 level. That's really the next level that we have. Technically. Mr. Fox. Yeah, Mr. ADA. Fox is nothing, guys. All right. Again, this thing looks like a better short to me, Rich, so just be careful. I'm only going to give 8410 a couple more minutes. Let's hope it doesn't go in that direction, but that's all I'm giving it. This market is pretty dead right now. Net net, right? And CHPT is just sitting, not doing anything, sitting in the middle of everything. UPST right back down. We do have a level in UPST at 100. Maybe we take a peek at that. 100 and then 99. You know what? I'm sticking to my guns. I ain't trading that thing. Anyone else who wants to trade it, 199 in UPST. 199. But I'm sticking to my guns. Palantir. Again, do we want to start a swing trade again in Palantir at 1830? Or do we think it's going to keep breaking down and go below that, right? 1820 was the weekly. That's where we started. And we added it at 1650. I don't know. Maybe it breaks that now. Not in a hurry. A R R Y. Yeah, I mean it's a better short A R R Y. It is not a buy. Better short. It's a better short. Qualcomm. So, everybody, Kevin, everybody in this room, everybody in the, in, in in Benzinga. All right. I'm not looking at stocks unless they make big moves to our moving averages, Kevin. So unless something moves down to one of our moving averages or up, not trading it. Not trading it. We need moves to, for us to set up technically. Mara's dead. Look at Mara, Carl. It's just sitting in the middle. It's had a 30-cent range. There's nothing to do. Oh, I love it, Born Free. Excellent. Roblex. What do we got in Roblex? What is 7030, guys? Is that the daily, Sal? In Roblex? I know you posted it earlier today. What level is it? So we got Roblex. Let's go find some support, right? 7119 is the 15 minute. Seventy forty is the thirty minute in Roblex, bingo. And that would be three dollars away from the moving average, so we like that. Again, I'll be a little aggressive down there. Do two hundred shares, seventy forty, fifty cent stop. I like it. You see, the longer you takes, the less I like it here, right? So I want it right now, you, or we're going to cancel. If this doesn't hit right now, I'm going to look for a lower level in you. Just taking too long. Just sitting here. It's not doing anything. Market's coming in a little bit. Let's look for another level. If we have one. Okay, we got nothing. 0, 0.0. I'm literally giving it 10 more seconds. Do, 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 do. I like to think we're the real deal. We do have losing trades, as you can see. <laughs> but we had a couple of winners this morning, too. All right. No likey. Canceling you for now. It's bouncing up anyway. Peloton. Yeah, Peloton is strong. I would buy Peloton. On a pullback to the trend. Absolutely. Soxel. We'll talk about that stuff later, Brian. Let's try to find a couple of trades if we can. Soxel, we have a swing point coming up. 
Oh, we're at 29.50. Forget it. Yeah, Ken, let me know if we get anywhere near there. That 27 level. Absolutely. One thing you cannot do if you have a bad trade, and we got a couple other ones in the room, you don't run back in to do something because that's a huge mistake that all traders make. I got to get that money back. I got to get that money back. No, thank you. Every trade you take with absolute discipline. Wow, TCAT. This is a wackadoodle stock, right? This is a wackadoodle stock. Can we short it? Let's look. Probably not. Um, nope. I can't short TCAT, so. so and, and this stock is whack. I'd rather be long than short. No, no revenge trading. Where are the spiders? Can't short the TCAT. It would have been a good short. But I don't have it available anyway. Look at that. How about that hit off pivot point and went down to $1.20? Is that crazy? Is that crazy? Of course, they don't let you short the ones you want to short, right? Ever. I can't do Roblox. That ain't happening. I mean, straight down a dollar off that pivot point. That's it, Buffalo. Facebook. Um, again, we got to – let's just see what the market does from here. It's hardly been 30 minutes for the double bottom in Facebook, you know? In Labu at 58.82. Let me take a look. All right. Just be careful with Labu. I mean, add a little at 58.30. Chad, and if it holds that, you're fine. But be careful on this one. If the market starts coming in, this one could be wackadoodle. So if you bought there, you got to add a little at 58.30 and then see if it holds. But it wasn't really, I mean, I guess it was kind of a trend. Yeah, you're okay. See what happens. See what happens. This is a mess to me, not really a trend. It's messy, but. See what happens. Playboy, a couple of Playboys I see popping up here. What do you got a 43 in Playboy? I got nothing. Just because the stock is going down doesn't mean I want to start buying it. 4150 would be a good spot in Playboy. Home Depot, Myrna. Let's look. All right, now, Chad, in um, Labu, start taking some profits up here and have a break-even stop. Okay? So, 58.50. Come on, buddy. Boom. Boom. Take a dollar, guys, in Labu. Nice job, Chad. Boom, chaka laka laka. All right, good. Good, 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 good. Nice trade. Do I think Neo is still long? Uh, a daily, longer term? Nope. Stock's in a horrible downtrend. Dodge Father, the best one ever, okay, that I've heard so far of the coins is D's Nuts. <laughs> Someone told me about it yesterday. I got to buy D's Nuts. Riot short. No, Riot's not a short. Not enough of a move. It is. It's D-E-E-Z. Yeah, Julian, I can't repeat that one. There's another one that I can't repeat. <laughs> but I like these nuts. Uh, I ain't messing with Upstart. It's a better short than a long anyway, but I'm not messing with it. Coin, let's look. I mean, look, coins in a trend. You can try 303. We just went up to what, 307? So, yeah, you can try coin at 303 small now. <laughs> uh, let's put it out small on coin. Small, 303. Again, this guy's like a dollar spread, guys. Don't like it. I just can't trade stocks with a dollar spread. I'm sorry. 
Riot may go back to 30. Well, let's take a look at that. Yeah, it could. So Riot is in a base, right? This is a giant base. It's going sideways for 30 minutes. So you buy Riot out of this base, your stop is 29. All right? Think or swim for charting, Tom, and interactive brokers for trading. So if you're buying this breakout in Riot, your stop is 29. I'd like to see a little volume, but not a bad play because it's a base trade. I ain't, Anyone mentions UPST in my room again, and they're going down. All right? <laughs> yeah, 107.50 is a short in UPST. Yes, 107.50. That is the spot if you want a revenge trade. <laughs> Actually, technically, it's setting up. So but I hate that stock. Obviously, I hated it before I traded it. You? Nah, you is dead. No orders in you. It's sitting doing nothing. Roblox, now we want to short it. We were looking to buy it down $3. Now you want to short it. Um, yeah. 73.90 is the short in Roblox. Yes. RBLX. Coming up from 71.80. 73.90 Roblox trend trade. We do. Are we starting with a five minute chart, Nick. And then we go from there. If we need to, to find support and resistance on different time frames. All right, Viacom. Again, I'd rather be long than short Viacom. I would not short it. It's not even up a diet, a dollar. Don't like it. Uh, uh, and this is why I hate UPS did. I didn't want to lose money on the way down and on the way up. <laughs> No, thank you. It's a stay away, guys. I, I, again, you guys know I hate that stock. I've said it a million times. I don't know why we got involved, but whatever we did. It's no big deal. All right, we'll give Roblox another minute here. Roku, 326, nice short in Roku. If it gets there, it's a better trend, though. We want to buy it. Mara spiked up 80 cents. I guess Bitcoin's going. Ooh, ee, ooh, uh. Sorry, guys. Yep. All right. Again, we just said Marit to buy the breakout, and you could have sold some and made a couple of banana skins, right? Yes, yes. Roblox 200 above is 74.33. Thank you. Thank you. So, guys, I have 95 people in my trading room right now. So I'm kind of managing both here and there. Um, I have room for another, what do I say, six and 21 people in my room, and then my room is shut. Waiting list will start. Guys in the room, how is everybody doing today? Everybody small red from our UPST trade, or have you guys caught anything else? Talk to me, room peeps. Talk to me. Cancel Roblox. We didn't get that. Kenny's green, no trade, small green, small red. Jimmy's green. Mike, red, 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 red. Yeah, just from that one trade, right? Small red, small green, no trades, good. No trades, good, 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 good. All my people waiting for the uh, boot camp, okay? I don't want you really trading, all right? Wait till after we do the boot camp. You got the rest of your lives to trade. So the boot camp is next week, a week from Monday. So everybody relax. I am in the green, Mr. Green. Yes, good. Excellent. Um, do we like you? Now, you just spiked up to 85.50. Yeah, I mean, let's do it if we get it right now. 84.10, but I want it now. 84. And the only reason I like it again now is because we just went up a dollar. So, But I want it now. That's me waiting for the boot camp. Yes, 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 yes. Everybody wait for the boot camp. Yes, 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 yes. yes. We'll talk about that stuff before we leave, guys. 
<sighs> UPST. Yep, another losing trade. Green from McKesson early, okay? Look, we had a very good day Monday. We had a very good day Tuesday. Yeah, that's fine, Diane. Wait, especially if you're a newbie. 100%. Just relax. Yeah, so I trade live with my traders every single day, guys and gals, um, in my trading room. I have 95 people in the trading room. My limit is 110, so I got room for 15 people. And then I do, uh, yeah, the boot camp's completely separate, Matt. My room is completely separate from the course that you guys have bought. Um, the course is spectacular, right? And we took 100 bucks off it for anybody who buys it from Benziger. And I mentor you every Thursday night when you buy the course. So forever. So once you have that course every Thursday night, I'm going to get together with you, and we're going to teach you all the stuff in the course that you have any questions with. My room is different. I do a live boot camp in my room once a month. Obviously, there's an upcharge and there's a charge for my room. But we can talk about that stuff later. I'll let everybody um, – the course is great. I mean, it really is. I'll let everybody come in um, for a five-day free trial that buys the course. So I'll give you, I'll give you the uh, link before we leave. If you buy the course, come on and hang out with us for five days. Yep, IHT got halted. We'll talk about it in a little bit, Danish. I got to get my money back, guys. <laughs> Again, cancel you now. I wanted it to go right there. Yes, I'm always looking at the Vixie. 100%. Yes. So, look, the spiders are getting smacked down here now, right? Let's go look where we are. Now, Nicholas, it's my computer. We're going to switch over to Zoom. Hopefully, I'll get that done this weekend. And we'll be all be on Zoom at some point next week. Um, who do I need? Who do I need in my room? Who's going to help me with my website and change all that stuff for me? Romeo, right? Yeah, I'm going to try to get to that this weekend. Yeah, that's the best part, Dip. I'm old, too. I'm 60 years old. So, But better than that, Dipper, is tomorrow night we're going to get together. And, you know, the mentorship is great. I'm going to answer any questions you have about the whole course. Boom, chaka, laka, laka. Dave, an old trade prior to being here, I have 70 shares of BTX at 44.33. Let me look. Should I buy more? BTX, 44.33. Oh, you can vault. I mean, I could see the stock going to 23. So what I would do, Melissa, is wait. And then double up if it goes to 23 by like 150 shares. Because that's the next real support I have. Yep. So if you double up at 43, at 23 from 43, your average would be about 30. Maybe it can get back there at some point. Again, anybody who is new to my room, who is part of my monthly fee and boot camp, tell me if you're in trouble at something and I will try and help you. All right. I'll give you my advice anyway. A lot of people who have come to me from uh, Benzinga have old positions in some stocks that they've got absolutely destroyed in. You know, getting caught up in the hype of all these crazy ones. So, not good. Not good. We'll talk about that, Snake. We're going to hang out for a little bit more, see if we can get a trade or two set up. Uh, Peloton. What do we got? 91.40. And 91. All right, let's take a look at Peloton. All right, let's do it tiny at 91.40, and we'll add it 91. Peloton. Try to get a trend trade. I like it. 91.40. Small. You? I canceled you. Guys, keep your eyes on my order box, right? I kept saying I don't like you because it was taking too long to get there. Nobody in the room bought you, okay? You can see on my order box I didn't have it on there, and I said I didn't like it because it was just taking too long to get there. 
So I will look for another spot in you. But I clearly stated that we do not like it anymore. I want things to go fast to get to our levels. I'm looking for another spot now. And I don't think I have any. That's why it was a big level. Nope. I got nothing in you. I mean, that ended up being a nice base below everything that just went down. All right, we got a little Peloton at 91.40, I think, 45. P-T-O-N. Got a little Peloton on a 9, so we want to add at 91 to that if we go back down. That'll be down $1.50 from the high. We'll add at 91. There's the market coming in, so I always want to look at the market to see what's going on. You know, and if the market starts pouring in here, that might not be such a good uh, trend trade, but we'll see. I definitely want to add at 91, and then we'll see what happens. 6.99. Okay. Let me look. I mean, Tesla yesterday. Oy. Oh, yeah, 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 all right, that's a conversation for another day, Carl. I can tell everybody, guys, if you guys have um, qualified to do the pre-IPOs, you really should start doing that rather than putting a lot of money into all these different stocks, okay? We have done spectacular in the IPOs, and... It's like putting money in a bank. I mean, we had Airbnb made 100 points. We had DoorDash made 100 points. I got SoFi now. We're doing very well in that one. Um, let's get rid of a little Peloton if we get to 9170. If, if, if. Just to make a trade. You know, if the whole market gets weak, Peloton's getting weak too. But let's try to get 30 cents out of some if we can. Uh, that spiders are bouncing a little bit. No, and a pre-IPO is when we get in before the stocks go public. So if you qualify, which is like $250,000 a year, million dollars in net assets, there's a few other ways you can do it. You can do it with your IRA. Um, and, you know, sometimes they take a year to go public. But they're usually pretty good investments. Oh, wow. Did you guys get the Roblox short at 73.50? That was nice. That was nice for a little trade ski. Coin 297. Let's look. Uh, yes, 297.50 actually, coin. Let's do it. So we're looking at coin. That's our 65 EMA. That would be down, I don't know, $6 from where we just were. All right, we took a little 30 cent profit in Peloton on some. Let's see what the next move is. 297.50. 297.50. I like coin down there. <laughs> so this Peloton, I don't know now, right? It's hitting, it's not doing anything. It's kind of just dead. We made 30 cents on a little bit. Wah, 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 wah. I don't want to add it 91 now. I certainly do not. So what I'm going to do in Peloton is, I'll show you guys. I'm going to put in a break-even stop. Stop, 15 shares. Oops, just went below it. I was going to say just get out at 90.40. We'll wait and see what the next move is. Because I don't even like 91 now. I messed up a buyer. And so uh, Fed talks today, really. No orders in Peloton now, guys. Cancel your orders. I don't like it. 
This market's coming in. Uh, let's go 90-40 in Peloton. See how I just didn't like that? I didn't like the trend, so we took 30 cents and we got out break even on some. Boom, chaka laka laka. Now, let's put out 90-40. Unless someone tells me the market's getting really bagel schmeared here. Right? Roblex. One thing we don't do, Jim. Oh, you're talking about trend trend? 7361. That's fine. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Got 7370 and then 7431. So you see how Peloton, I just kind of wasn't feeling it. Just wasn't feeling it. So we broke even and made 30 cents. Never trade a mistake. That is exactly right, my friends. And the market's rallying again a little bit. We did not do anything in coin, Jeff. We wanted to buy it down at this 297.50, but we didn't get it. GTPB. GTPB. Oops. GTPB. What the hell is that? This thing looks like it trades about five shares a day. <laughs> Dar, we got a buy alert in Dar. Well, so did a lot of other people. It just spiked up to 78, says. <laughs> so looks like everybody got a buy alert in Dar. Let us know if you're going to jump in somewhere. IBD swing trade. All right, thank you. I don't think it trades enough volume. Uh, it looks like it does. Silver. Silver's dead. Not doing anything. Yeah, I see it says NLOK. NLOK. Yeah, this is a nice trend trade, NLOK. Look at that. Beautiful. UPST. <laughs> oh. Say it ain't so, UPST. Negative. 150 UPST would be a nice spot. Boom, chaka, laka, laka. Mr. Roku. All right, wait for the 15 in Roku, though, 316.50. I would wait a little bit. I mean, you want to try a tiny at 317.70, but 316.50 is the trend trend, and that's down $5. Peloton missed by five cents. Cancel. Cancel Peloton, you son of a beeswax. So look, guys and girls, right? We wanted to buy 90.40. We missed by five cents, and it gave us a 35-cent trade already. Boom, chaka, laka, laka. Yeah, we missed it. I think it's going to break that anyway if we go down. RBLX. Ah, nice short, guys. So here, a bunch of guys in the room just got this. What the F is that? Are you kidding me? What did I do? I got to get rid of something. Nope. Nope. <laughs> All right, guys. Someone help me get rid of this. What do I got to hit? Come on, really? I want to get rid of this stuff on the side. Hit the AT button on far right. What's AT? Where is that? Active Trader? Yep, hit that Hit that Active Trader button. Well, it's still not getting rid of this no. other shit. Um. Push only the chart button on the side. Nope. That ain't working. <laughs> Untab dashboard. All right. Let's try that. Nope. <laughs> Untap everything but Active Trader. So tap the chart real quick. Tap uh, big buttons. You know, try... What do you yeah. usually have up? Just the active trader? And the, there we go. 
Now, untab active trader. All right. Uh, yeah, untap. There we go. Nope. Uh, at least we can see the charts. <laughs> yeah, we got times and sales. I want to get rid of that. You, Where is it? Uh, click that. Click times and sales up on the second. To, uh, to Yeah, click that one right there. Hey. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Hey, Gavelt. Anyway, guys, bunch of traders in the room just got this short in Roblex. Trend trade, 73.44, just gave a dollar trade in it. All right? How many guys got that? That is beautiful. You're selling Roblex? We shorted Roblex. Nick, you got some of that? Jim? That was perfect. This has just been in a horrible downtrend all day. And it rallied up $2. And there you go. Nice job, guys and gals. There you go. That makes up for the UPST. Boom, chaka, laka, laka. Again, I don't like Palantir, guys. I'm not doing anything in Palantir. 0.0. .0. We made $3 on that trade yesterday. Is anyone in Texas that don't mind leaking up? I normally will hold 25. Yeah, Jim, that's good. You can make the uh, most money on that. It's good. I don't mind that. You hold on to a little bit, trail a stop, and see where it gets you. That is the key. Oh, God, UPST. Really? Do I have to go back to this well and start buying it at 150? Maybe I'll just buy 500 shares. Try to get all my money back. <laughs> yeah. Look at the VIX, guys. Wow. People are buying a lot of protection in this market, ladies and gentlemen. All right? I mean, a lot. What does that mean? People are worried about this market getting a little correction coming in. I mean, look at this stock now. This is day two. This has room to 49 bucks, guys. So, not in a hurry. You know, if the spiders break this morning's low, which we're not even close to, but if we do, I think we start seeing some acceleration to the downside. Well, I would want to short trends is the answer, KH, yes. So, I want to be shorting stocks that are going up and hitting their trend lines. Yeah, Tesla, if it gets back up to 608, is a short now. Roblex was a perfect example of a short when it got up to the trend line. All right? So when the market's going down, I don't want to try to pick a bottom in stocks. I want to try to short them if it sets up and gets to one of our trend lines. I'll, I'm going to show you guys yesterday the Tesla trade that a bunch of people in my room had. And you guys were here. It was spectacular. Pre-market. I want to show you something. Yesterday, pre-market, Tesla hit $578. It doesn't show on here because it was pre-market. It hit $578, which was the level. Yeah, people in my room did that also, KH. Our level was $578, and it went up $20 from there. And exactly hit it yesterday morning. That's where we, we got the PLTR at 1650 yesterday morning also. Um, I'm going to say over 250000 bucks in my room yesterday on a couple of stocks. We do, KH. 88% last month. You know, it's funny. Um, well, you guys are with us. We were together Monday, Tuesday. We had nothing but good trades the last two days. I think yesterday we had like six trades with you guys. And they all worked in the first hour. I've had one trade today. I lost money on it. But keep in mind also, okay, I'm here to teach people, right? I'm 95 there. I got 400 here. It doesn't matter to me if I get all the trades or not. It means nothing. You know, my P&L means absolutely nothing, up, down, or sideways. As long as my, my room gets a trade. Yeah, but again, that's not what we do. You know? 
Averaging into stocks is a recipe for disaster. Uh, well, let's see if this would have worked. 150 was the level in UPST. And then 99 is another level. Four hundred k blown. Yeah, it's, I know. I, uh, not telling me anything new. Spies at lows. Here we go, guys. All right, so let's go to the daily chart and the spiders weekly. All right, so here it is. Okay, four oh nine. We're not there yet, but four oh nine is our weekly trend line. That's a big level. Big level. I'd buy call options, Kevin, in the VXX. That's probably what I would do if we expect something really big. Yeah, because they're not that expensive. Buy 50s for this week or something. But that's a giant level, 409. We got a gap down to 401 after that, which we talked about. We talked about that yesterday with everybody. Um, um, now, okay, we got to be careful buying anything now, right? Uh, how do you how do you trust that something's going to hold when the market is getting crushed? Well, not crushed, but going down. Ah, so here was the spot in UPST, guys, ninety nine twenty, right? The second level we had, ninety nine twenty, off. The pivot point gave a dollar trade. That was the spot for a trade anyway. All right. Now, if it goes back down, it's going lower, but it gave you a quick dollar off 99.10. So that was the little spot. We just got to be careful now, guys, right? Boeing, I ain't buying Boeing at 225. Nope. I know it's $1.50 away, but I do not mind everybody okay let's just keep our hands in our pockets a little bit i don't i don't, I don't trust this market now if we break 409 we're going to see some acceleration to the downside so let's just be patient again look we've been here before right yesterday we were here and the market went up 600 points so Doesn't mean we're going to keep going down from here. Do I change any settings to the pivot points? Mine look no. Always the same. The pivot points. I don't change them. Negative. You know, it's the same thing that what market did yesterday all day. We went down. We went down. We went down. We went down, and then the market spiked up 500 points at one point, right? And one of the things I said yesterday. LQDT was well, one of these days it's going to go down and it's not going to stop going down. Who's got that microphone off? And I, I hear you. I hear a doggy. <laughs> if you haven't noticed the past two and a month, two and a half months, we've been ripping like the 11 to two area. Yeah. So, you know, we got to wait. We got to wait. Stace, I recommend that everybody gets think or swim for trading. Um, it's great. I mean, not for trading, but just for charting. This, everyone in my room is using think or swim for charting. And then we can help you figure out how to set everything up if you decide to purchase the course and stay with us. WKHS. I don't think anything, Brandon. Long term, I'll give you a look. See, this is horrible. So this is one of the stocks, Brandon, that a bunch of people who have come to me got caught in. Right, this Palantir, Fubo, CCIV, yada yada yada, and they're just horrible. I bought the course, can't figure it out. What do you mean, Doodles? You gonna you gonna get a log on and a password? Let me show you. Let me see. Wall Street Global Trading Academy. Once you enroll, 
You should get a logon and password. And then where it says members area, you're going to go. And once you're in the members area, see, you got your email and your password. Log in. And you're going to see all the course pop up. Boom. Right from the beginning. Stock market basics. Language of the stock market. Money management. Chart basics. Trading techniques. Swing trading. Options trading. Bitcoin. Thursday night meetings. Every Thursday night. So you should get a login and password and get to go in. Okay. What we've done for all the Benzinger people... Wall Street Global Trading Academy. Aaron will pop it up. Might as well pop it up now while we're talking about it. Um, to buy the course, it's Wall Street Global Trading Academy. Dot com. Wall Street Global Trading Academy. Dot com. And there it is. And once you sign up, you'll get the logon, you'll get the password, and I'll see you tomorrow night. Also, anyone who signs up, I'm going to give you the next seven days in my trading room. For free. Because the week after next, we have our boot camp. So I don't have anybody visitors for that. But anyone who signs up today, okay? And again, we did this just for Benzinga. We took 20% off. Boom, chaka, laka, laka. So it's normally 500 bucks, right? So anyone who signs up today, I'm going to give you the next seven days for free in my room. All right? If you sign up and buy this today, you'll get seven days in my room. So anyone who signs up, let me know, and we'll give you the link. Look, we'll be on the honor system. Aaron, can you post the link to my room? Greenroom-live.com. Greenroom-live.com. Please, if you purchase the course, yes, you can come in today immediately, Matt. Yes. Or you can take your five. Look, normally I give five. I'm giving seven because it's Wednesday. So I'll give everybody Thursday, Friday, and next week. Okay. All right. Yeah, come hang out first, KH. Don't worry about signing up for my room or anything. I will put it, I will save a spot for you if it's something you want to do. Don't worry about it. All right. Halfway through the course, people in your room, how do we join the room? Is it a Discord? No. It's through Webinato. I am trading live all day long. You just got the link, greenroom-live.com. So you go there. You're going to use password green15. You're going to download Webinato, and you're going to enter the room. Okay? So anyone who bought it, you got seven days with me, and I normally do five. Anyone who buys it today, come in and join us for the next seven days. Okay? But we're on the honor system. So if you don't buy the course, don't try and sneak into my room. I know every single person who's in there. <laughs> So, ah, uh, here we go. I mean, look, we're right on the weekly nine now, right? We're on it. So this is a this is a big spot. You know, if we break down from here, we're going lower. David, I still haven't. Looks like I need to ask you about three or swim contact. Oh, all right, Donna. So you need a um, you need someone to help you with think or swim. Is that correct? Getting it set up. Uh, KH, you should not have a problem problem buying the course. Whatever. Talk about that when we get in the room. Don't worry about it for now. Don't worry about the money. Chillax. All right, Donna, send me an email. I'm going to send you a guy in my room, David Fisher's email, and he will help you. Okay, I'm sorry if I haven't gotten back to you yet. I will forward you someone's email, or better yet, David, David, are you here? All right, uh, how am I going to do this? David, post your email. Let me, I can't do that either. Um, all right, Donna, just send me an email, and I'll forward you David's email, and he'll help you out. Okay, I promise I'll get to it. Yeah, I can't copy and paste that in the other room, though, Dave. So don't, don't sweat it. I'll, I will forward that to her when she uh, 
gets in contact with me. All right. Let me show you guys, if you purchase the course, how to do this. Greenroom-live.com. Yeah. Just go here, guys. Five-day free trial. It tells you the password. Green 15. Click on it. This is going to come up. You're going to download Webinato. You're going to open Webinato. What you going to do without him? This is going to pop up. I am an attendee. Put your email in, password, and then enter the webinar. So I am an attendee. Email, password, enter webinar. So the password is green15. It's on the website. What market data bundles you can run? Um, I have Interactive Brokers Pro. And that includes everything that I need. So it's IB Pro. Pelantar falling. Everything's going to be falling now, guys and gals. Again, you know. Look, how long does the Thursday access last after the course ends? Forever, Andy. As long as I'm around, we do those Thursday nights every Thursday night. Yep, I'm going to be with you for as long as I'm here. <laughs> Knock on wood. Good question, Stacy. I'm not sure. That's a good question. Well, I'm telling you guys, we're at a big level now. So we haven't broken it yet. Again, let's go to the weekly. We didn't break it. It's 408.90 is the exact level, 408.90. So we're not there yet. Look, we can get a big bounce off that. Who knows? Apple. 121. Apple, I like at the 118, 119 range. I don't like it here. I mean, maybe for a trade. Yeah, I mean, UPST is just a piece of crap. Talk about a good short, right? So, look, let's look at UPST. The next level we have is $89, and we're going to get a bounce off of $89, right? No doubt. That's down $8 from here. That would be a good trade. It's kind of been a morning to keep your hands in your pockets. I hate to say it. It just has. Um, Tesla, if it test, can test the double bottom again at that 579 level, if we get ugly. So... 579 is the daily level. And if we break that, right, here it is, 579, call it 580. If we break 580 in Tesla, I got to go to a weekly chart. Now, 490 is the next spot. All right, Billy, thank you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Purchase the course. Some of you guys are coming who purchased the course and getting in the room already. Cool. Let me know, like Billy just did, um, if you bought the course and you're coming to the room so we can, I know that you're new and we can chat and hang out. Ah, okay, Sam. So this is all the technical analysis that we use, right? If you want to write this down, I'll tell you. It's all in the course, but I'll tell you. So we use a 9 EMA. A 15 EMA, excellent, Matt. A 65 EMA and a 200 EMA. Those are the moving averages that we use. Then we have pivot points, which are these dotted lines that you see. And we have a relative strength index. Excellent, Mike. Ah, good, Matt. And the most important thing for anyone who's buying this course is when we get together tomorrow night, Ask me questions. We hired a new mediator in the room who's going to help us with all the questions and everything. Last week was fantastic, right? We had a great meeting last week, and it's only going to get better from that. So all the technical analysis we use. Yes, Bill. 
We're on the honor system. You can hang out today. Yes, 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 yes. You buy it today. You can hang out for the next seven days. Um, 9, 15, 65, and 200. Okay. Then we have pivot points and our relative strength index. Excellent, Mike. You're cool. Mike, you can hang out all of next week also. Okay. All good. You. And you at 86. 86. Short, I hope. Not long. Media. Are you long this or short it? I hope you're short. This has been nothing but a short all day. I mean, I think you's going to own $79. The one thing we can look at, guys, okay, if the spiders go to 409, and again, we're kind of hanging out here, maybe short a little VXX. But I'm telling you guys, people, I kind of mentioned it yesterday, people are buying a shitload of protection in this market. When the VXX is going up, that means people are worried about the market going down. And that's exactly what's happening right now. Roblex, let's look. So, you know, I don't want to go back to the well too many times in Roblex. You know, it worked great up here. What is this? 7280. I mean, I would wait a little bit now in Roblex. You know, let's wait for the VWAP, 7330. I like that better. 7330 now. Let's wait a little bit. More times it hits the trend, the more likely it is maybe to bust through the trend. So let's be patient. Peloton on the 200 EMA. All right, well, we're trying to hold it, right? We're coming down from 9060. All right, so let's look at Peloton, right? Where do we want to be if we break down from here? You know, if it doesn't hold this, 8830 could be a really nice spot, right? That's our pivot point. Look, if you get a green bar from here now, that's the way to play this. You don't commit. If you get a green bar, you buy a little with a tight stop. But if we break through here, let's go 88.30. Because that'll be one, two, three green bars down in a row. Three red bars in a row. And I like that. Would you mind talking a little about what you mean by far from moving average play? All right, I'll see if I can see one that's set up. Banana, Dana, Bird. Give me a minute. So, you know, we're trying to hold right here, Peloton. It's trying to hold. So, like I said, you could have bought a little bit right there and have like a 30 cent stop. Because it hit the 200 EMA. Uh, SPY. What do you got? 409.15 to help with the VIX spy imbalance. Well, again, 408.80 is the gigantic level in the spiders. 408.80. Here's the gag, guys, right? You think we're going to hold these levels? We short a little VIX. What's the consensus in the room? Talk to me, gooses. Welcome, Kent. What do you guys think? I mean, we're getting a little stretch in this VIX, right? It's a very big level. I don't know. I'll leave it up to you guys. You guys think we bounce? All right. I don't mind trying a little Vixy short if we get there. When he says go short or long, he's talking about short. Yes, Manny. Everything we're talking about in this room is short-term trading. I will help you if you want with anything long-term, but we're day traders, swing traders, and options traders. So, yeah. Everything you hear me say I'm buying or selling is for sometimes five minutes, ten minutes. All right. So, you guys okay if we start and then add a little bit? In the Vixie. I'm just going to do 10 shares of Vixie for now. 
just to have a little mark around. Let's see if we get to our level. I think it's getting there. Coin. Coin. Oh, all right. We missed it. 297.70 was coin. I don't know if I like that either. Again, guys and gals, let's see if these levels hold around here. If these levels hold, we can jump in and start buying some stuff. All right? So Vixie is probably going to be around 45.50 when we hit that level. 45.50. I'll put another 10 shares out there. We'll see what happens. Always starting on a five-minute chart, guys. Yeah, Elva, that's fine. It's fine. What you gonna do about him? You're gonna have to do without him. I am gonna keep it very small in VIX, guys, because I don't even mind, you know, getting into a 50, 100 chair position every 50 cents or whatever. I don't mind that. Let's just keep it very small. So when the stock hit the 200 EMA and bounce, no, I would not do it again. Absolutely not. No. So if we're looking at coin, right? Let's say coin did bounce off here. If it got there again, I would not do the trade. No. Half hour away from the sell-off into lunch. Could be voo voo. It could. So we just got a nice bouncing coin off the pivot point. Look at that. 296.38. That gave a dollar boppy bippity bop. That was the spot for a little trade ski. Just stocks, Eli, but we do trade options. Just stocks, but we do trade options. I think the Vixie's getting a little overdone here, too. So I don't know. We'll start a little short position, see what happens. Only the first time down, KH. I am never doing a stock second time it hits one of my levels. Ever. First time down. Facility. Yes, Facility looks like a falling knife. Yes. <laughs> Everything does, guys. So you just short today. That was the thing to be, right? Yep. Markets are rendi. Do I think the bull market is over? Absolutely not. No. I think we're due for a correction. That's what I think. Which I've been talking about for a while, if anyone's been in my room. How much of one we're going to get? I don't know. We'll see. All right, so the tiny bit of VIX at 45.50. Gonna put in a little to sell at $46. Again, guys, I'm gonna stay with this trade a little bit, okay? I just think we're getting a little bit overdone here. So I have 10 shares. I'm not real worried about it. Some of them are down a lot more than that 50%, 60%, 70%. You know? I'm going to add 10 shares of VIX every 50 cents, guys, and hold on to it for a little bit. I think at some point today we probably give a big bouncy bounce, or if not, we'll have a little bit of stock. That's all. Well, when they talk about the overall market, Brent, they don't care about individual stocks. They care about the S&P. That's all they care about. Some stocks are down 40, 50, you know, 60, 70%. But when they talk about the market and having a correction, they're talking about the S&P 500. So it's not a bloodbath. This is not a bloodbath. You could, most of the people I'm talking to in this room probably have never seen a bloodbath. <laughs> I don't even know what it is. We're starting to slow down a little bit, David. Yeah, we're good, Aaron. If you got to do your thing, that's fine. Yep, we got to wrap up here. All right, listen. 
Uh, just to wrap it up, guys, anyone who buys the course today, you're going to get seven days with us in the room. Um, I'll put that link up there one more time. Throw it in the chat. Wall Street Global Trading Academy dot com. All right. Ladies and gents, just uh, keep everything small today. I would not uh, be a hero as far as trying to buy stuff this morning. My pleasure again. We'll be back, I think, Monday. I think you guys have uh, some stuff, great stuff lined up for your people t- tomorrow and Friday, right? Yeah, we, um, have a, we have a small cap conference. Actually, here, hang around for, for a second, David. We got a little, uh, little promo video for that I'm going to play. Excellent. Excellent. And before you even do that, guys and girls, I have Benzinga Pro, and I don't think I could trade without it. So everybody who's in this room should definitely consider getting involved with the Benzinga News Service. It is the best that I have ever used. Um, Just so you guys know also, this is the first collaboration I've ever done with anybody because I love these guys and they're the real real deal. But I have – one trade sometimes will pay for 10 times what I pay for the Benzinger News, the Benzinger Pro News. Um, it is the greatest. Yep, and, and I just very- I just threw that uh, in the link, and that comes with a 14-day free trial too. So if you want to just check it out, you know, oh, great. You, got some, you got some time to do that, and uh, it's a no, no commitment. You don't need to put a credit card down or anything. Um, and, yeah, Roman, you're right. We do need some more likes. Come on, y'all. Hit the like for David. He's out here giving us trades every day, you know. Smash that like. All right, let me play this quick promo, and then we'll, we'll be good to go. It's a catchy beat, ain't it? <laughs> All right, David. Well, well unfortunately, yeah, not, not, not any stream tomorrow or Friday, but we'll see you uh, next week. I'll be here Monday morning. All guys, right. anyone, um, I hope to see a bunch of you guys in the room. Sounds good. Good trade. All right, David. We'll talk later. All right, bye.